Hey YouTube, TechSnack9 here again today, and um, I'm sorry I didn't post anything yesterday about a useful tip or a video or anything like for that. Um, it was a nice day outside, so I just you know hung out with friends and all that, did all that fun stuff. But I'm um, actually today um was not that good, so I'm actually gonna be making a video today, and I'll try to make a video every single day. Hopefully I can. Um, so anyway, today I'm actually gonna be showing you how to install a uh, Clockwork Mod Recovery into your um, Samsung Galaxy S2. T989 phone, T-Mobile right there. Um, this actually I made another video on is um how to root your um T-Mobile T989 phone. Um, but um that's how to root it. It's the same process except you don't actually um install the SD card file. So um I'll just show it to you. It's the same exact process except just you don't do the end part. Um, so actually let's get started. Um, first make sure it's plugged in. All right, so. It's plugged in, and then um, I will have a link in the description. Um, these are my own personal files, so you don't have to worry about viruses or anything. It's uh, um, on foreshare.com. So you would install that, it would install that. You just un -R 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 -A -R it, and then you get these two files. Just double tap on that, alright. Then you come with this. Um, it's, it's Odin, like you've seen it before if you saw my other videos. And that's all, and then you got that, alright. So let's just put these all three on the desktop. So it's a lot, it's just easier to find. Alright. Alright. It's right there. Alright, so um so your phone's plugged in and make sure it's plugged into the computer. So um so all you're gonna do is do the uh, power button and the volume buttons all at the same time, you know that whole thing. If you haven't seen this video, um just follow me. So we're gonna be doing um up down up button and down button and the power button all at the same time and when you feel vibration let go of the power button but keep holding on to the volume up and down button. So let's do it. Hold on to all three. All three. When you feel vibration let go of the power button. Alright, let go. Alright, now, just press the up button, just a warning. Don't worry, it won't mess up your phone, I promise. Alright, now here, I just set it aside. Alright, now, you're going to be opening Odin. Let's see that better. Alright, um, just open up Odin. Just want to click yes. Alright, now see, you can see it's yellow here, that's a good sign, that means um, it, de it detects your phone on your computer. If it does not detect your phone, um, just try it again, and um, for that to be detected, make sure you have Samsung Skies, or Kies, K-I-E-S, uh, installed. If you don't know what it is, um, just download it, just Google it, and it's on the Samsung website. So that's it. So anyway, um, all you want to do is make sure only auto reboot is checked up on here, and nothing else is checked. So now you're going to click on PDA, only PDA, make sure it's PDA. Then you're going to scroll it down and um, find until you find a recovery-cmw-hercules.tar. Uh, you want to open that up. Alright, after that, see how it's checkmarked, tells you where it's located. You just want to tap start. Alright, see how it shows its recovery. This will only take about... um. A couple minutes, I'm pretty sure it takes a couple minutes. Um, so I'll be back when it um, finishes. Alright. Alright, guys, um, it just finished. It only took about um, 30 seconds. So um, after that's done, um, you want to unplug your phone and um, now you want to enter Clockwork Mod Recovery. Um, that's the same thing we just did, holding out all the power buttons and all that, and make sure it's un unplugged. So um, hold down everything. It should still work when it's turned off. When you feel vibration, you know, like, okay, feel vibration. It does work when it's turned off, and let go of the power. Just keep holding. And yes, we are in there. And now, let's see if you can see that actually. Uh, it's all right. You can, yeah, it's clear now. Um, see, um, it's it, it will be a blue screen, and um, it will have all these options if you done it correctly. So it's a very good sign. Um, congratulations, you just got. Clockwork my recovery onto your um Samsung Galaxy S2 T9 and phone. Um, congr congratulations. And um, I just want to tell you why you would want this. Um, I would like 
tell every single person who has actually this phone to get it because this is a very useful to install like dark side super wipe custom rams like custom rams so you can get rid of bloatware and make your um overclock your um current ram or anything like that um it's very very useful and it does not void the warranty right because you can always just get rid of this it's very useful um it doesn't mess up your phone it doesn't make it go any slower anything like that any rumors um it's actually really great so that's about it guys and um, before you do anything, I'll just um, advise you to actually, how you know, it says back up and restore. You just want to click on the power button, and I would highly recommend you um, back up before you do any um, custom ROM or anything like that. All right. So um, thanks guys, thanks for watching. Um, and once again, um, rate, comment, or if you haven't already, subscribe. Uh, thanks guys, thanks for watching. Um.